What's up guys, welcome to this video. In today's video I want to quickly show you how you can fix the issue if you're um, running into the error code GTA 5 stopped working. That's the topic of today's video, so just stick around if you're interested in it. But before we start right into the topic, I would really like to mention something. You guys would certainly make my day if you could leave a like, comment and subscribe to my small little YouTube channel. It would mean a world to me, so thank you very much. But let's start right into the topic. What do you need to do in order to fix this issue? First of all, um, make sure to find your GTA 5 installation files. So um, if you are running or playing GTA 5 on your Epic Games launcher, then make sure to head over to your um, Epic Games library and then click on the three buttons or three dots by um, at your uh, GTA 5 and then click on manage. And then you should see right next to your in uninstallation button uh, icon where you can open your installation folder or if you're using Steam then just um, works very similarly just um, in your library right click on your GTA 5 and click on properties and then change over to local files and there should also be an option to open your installation files and then when you found it um, yeah I'm just going to open it real quick for you as well perfect and then when you found it uh, this should look something like this with all of these folders and files in it and then make sure to find this gta5.exe application file uh, with about 60 megabytes. Just right click on it, select it, right click, right click on it and click on properties. And then we're going to change over to the compatibility tab where we um, have to set a few settings. First of all, I would suggest you to run this program in compatibility mode for, check the setting here and then Windows 8 is perfectly fine. And also down here at the settings, I would uh, suggest you to disable the full screen optimizations and to run this program as an administrator every time you launch it. Um, makes awesome sense in my opinion. And then just click on apply. And if you're playing GTA on two or more users, this uh, button here maybe makes sense to you. But for the most, just click on OK. And uh, we can already close this and run our GTA 5 um, again and the issue of uh, GTA 5 stopped working should be fixed. Really hope this helped you guys. If you've got any questions just let me know in the comment section below. Then I'll write you back as soon as possible and we will surely find a solution. But that's it. Thanks so much for watching. I wish you a wonderful day. See you in the next video. Bye.